Milwaukee is ranked 17th among 70 of the largest cities in the nation, according to a report looking at trends for rape, robbery and aggravated assault. But one of the eye catching increases homicides. A report obtained by Target 7 shows Albuquerque has been seeing an increase in homicides, something Mayor Tim Keller has been talking about since September of last year. We have two challenges working against us. One is national trends that are all getting worse. So, you know, we have to do what we can in our city, but when there's a tidal wave of crime across America, it's going to affect us. According to this report by the Major Cities Chiefs Association, Albuquerque had one of the worst homicide rates in the nation. The report says in 2021, there were 106 homicides. For 2022, 115, an 8% increase. This is something Albuquerque police talked to KOAT about at the end of the year. Really spiked. It's, it's become tougher to solve these cases. According to the report, Albuquerque is one of 27 cities across the nation that saw an increase. APD says they charged or arrested 97 suspects in connections to homicide in 2022. In the end, it's helped us really bring uh, a sense of justice to a lot of the families, a sense of closure. The boyfriend of Su Wei Fong, an Asian woman killed in early 2022, is still haunted by her murder at the wonderful massage business. We never thought that it would come to a situation where you know she would uh, she would lose her life. The major cities chiefs association report shows the 70 cities that were looked at in 2022 indicated there was a 5% drop in homicides nationwide. Other nearby cities like Phoenix saw a 13% increase in homicide homicides. Meanwhile, north of us in Denver, they reported an 8% decrease in homicide. For Target 7, Stephanie Muniz, KOT Action 7 News. Our hour south, the city of El Paso saw a 28% decrease in homicides, one of the highest drops in the report.